What's up everybody? My name is Keith and I am here to show you how to get to Sleepy Hollow, aka the place where I took these lovely pictures. <laughs> Now, if you've been wanting to go here to hike, maybe take some pictures, or maybe you just want to go here to well go so you can see everything, well, I got some really good news for you. You just have to watch this video and I will show you exactly what to do. First, go to your Maps app if you have a smartphone, or if you could go to maps.google.com, you type in Glendale Hills Trailhead, or you could type in the address 2706 Sleepy Hollow Drive, Glendale, California, 91206. All that information will be in the description below this video, so you can copy and paste it. But to make everything easy, if you have Google Maps on your phone, Glendale Hills Trailhead, it'll bring you exactly where you want to be. And when you park there, it's going to look something like this. You should end up somewhere that looks like this. So... There's some houses and there's always going to be parking. If not over there, there's some parking over here. Look at all that parking. There's going to be parking. Don't you worry about it. But yes, keep on walking and right here. You're going to end up at this gate. You don't have to jump over anything or nothing sketchy. You're gonna follow this trail. You're gonna see some nice people. Always some nice people. The trail is beautiful. During summertime, it gets pretty like it's just brown, so it's not that pretty. But when we get green, it's nice, as you can see. But all right, let's go. Let's go to where we're gonna really go. By the way, I didn't give any directions of where you're gonna walk because you don't need any. You're gonna walk straight and that's it, okay? All right, let's go back. All right, guys, so I've been walking for five minutes exactly. We are not at the point yet, but we are very, very close. So let's fast forward again. Woo! All right, guys, it's been exactly six and a half minutes since I started this video. And as you can see, Here. Since it's very foggy, you can't really see LA. I mean, you know, you know what that is. You know LA. But yeah, after seven minutes of walking, we're gonna get a real treat. I'm not talking about this kind of treat. I'm talking about that kind of treat. So here's Eagle Rock in all of its glory. I really hope everyone gets a chance to come see this. It doesn't have to be tomorrow. It doesn't have to be next week. It really doesn't have to be any time until you want to. There's rock. Now, when you get here, it's pretty windy. It could get pretty cold. Luckily today, it's not that bad. Um, I want to talk about the first time I went here and it was the first time in my life that I really felt small. As you guys know, I am not a small person. I am an extra large person. But when I saw our whole town and how close it is to downtown LA, I noticed how small everything looks and that stuff usually looks huge to me because I'm close to it. And just because I'm a little far away, everything looks tiny all of a sudden. I don't know. I gained a really huge perspective after going here and I keep coming back because obviously it's beautiful and there's some really good pictures to be taken. Does this look familiar? <laughs> But yes, there are more trails over here. If you go right there, or at least right over there, you're gonna see more of Glendale and Burbank. I don't know why you wanna see that, but if you want to, go for it. 
The real deal though, Eagle Rock. Eagle Rock Boulevard, Citibank, goes up all the way there. There's York because it turns. Yeah. Big mistake though, when you're going back home, I'll show you. After hanging out here for a while, you might get a little too excited and forget which path to go on to go home. There's here, there's here. I, I think you understand you didn't park up there, but there's these two paths. And I'm not gonna lie, I just went down this path because I thought it's the right path, even though I've been here like 10 times, but it indeed is right here. I don't know, I guess since when you come down here and then you go up, you're thinking to go back, you just go down. But instead, I'm not lying, you have to go over here and you will make it back to your car. I wanna thank you guys so much for watching and thank you for liking all my photos in the past, commenting your kind words, telling me that you love the photography. Obviously, I don't even know who you are because, well, we just live in the same neighborhood, but for you to say something nice to me about something that I love doing, it really hits home. And I've got some really exciting news for everybody. Anyone that's liked my videos or photos, it is coming soon. So stay tuned and stay in love with Eagle Rock because that's what I am. I love Eagle Rock. I love the people there. I love everyone involved. And yeah, I just love how I can make these videos to help you guys because that's exactly what I want to do. I love helping people. And if I could help you with my photography or videos, then I know I'm doing my job. My name is Keith. Thank you so much again. I will see you soon. Bye-bye.